family of a woman killed in a hit and run once answers. Phoenix police are investigating the deadly crash that happened late Friday night. The victim 43 and within the crosswalk moments before her death. Fox 10's Justin Lum reports. Angela Milligan Zamoran was walking across Northern Ave when police say a car driving at high speed collided with her. But the suspect kept on going and Angela's family wants justice. It's like a horror movie. A family devastated, Robert Zamoran watched Phoenix police clean up the aftermath early Saturday morning hours after his sister, Angela Zamoran, had been killed. The hit and run crash took place at 31st Avenue Northern around 9.30 last Friday night. Robert says he recently saw Angela, who battled depression and drug addiction. He had been trying to get her help. You no, know, she just, it seemed like some junkie on the street, but she was loved. I loved her a lot. That was my big sister. A mother of 10, her oldest, Dominique, says she'll miss her voice and laughter. She was my best friend, and she was everything to me, and I always had hope, so I always have good memories of her no matter what. Police say the suspect vehicle is a light-colored car that was speeding west on Northern before hitting Angela. She was walking across the street from the Circle K, her mother heartbroken. For, as a mother, I wish it would have been me, not her, any time in my life. I'd give my life for her any day. Bertha says on the same day she lost her daughter, she also lost her brother 16 years ago in a hit and run in Phoenix. Loved ones hope the suspect in Angela's case is watching. I wish that they come forward. Just come forward. It's worse if you stay and they catch you. It'll be worse on your part. Just come forward. You can see a family member left a small memorial in honor of Angela. If you have any information, please call Silent Witness at 480 Witness. And for anyone who would like to help the family with funeral expenses, we have more information on Fox10Phoenix.com. In Phoenix, Justin Lum, Fox 10 News.